So what is the moron threshold? The moron threshold value is basically the amount of time that the craft must remain motionless before the gyro is calibrated. During that time, the moron threshold is measuring gyro noise and doing calculations. This happens every time you plug in a battery. Those are the three beeps or LED flashes that happen a few seconds after powering up. The current default value for the moron threshold is 48. It can be set from 0 to 200. The lower the value, the quicker the gyro is going to initiate calibration, but it might not have enough time to accurately read the data from the gyro. The higher the value, the more time it gives the flight controller to accurately read the gyro data and do more precise calculations. If your quad's not harming properly and you have an advanced gyro, you're running fast loop times, or if you've had a bad crash, all of these things can increase gyro noise. So you might need to give the craft more time to read the gyro data by raising the moron threshold. It's always a good idea to plug in your lipo and quickly make sure that the craft is level and not moving around. There can be many reasons why your quad won't arm, and this feature runs every time that you boot up, so if you're having problems arming and you checked everything else, you might want to take a look at the moron threshold. This video shows how to adjust the value, and I'll also leave instructions in the description below. So this has been the Moron Threshold. I hope this helps, and thanks for watching.